How's it going, everyone? Marilyn here, and it's time for more Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team DX. One day, in a small cave in the distant west, Hey, get a move on! Ugh. This is rough going. Heh, what's with you? You're gonna whine about it now? Let me think, wasn't it you who wanted to explore this place? Saying you'd found a new cave and all. Yeah, I just happened to be swimming by in the sea when I spotted this cave. I didn't expect it to be a dungeon this rough. Huh. <sighs> Heh. I thought a different team would be a good change of pace. But you're pathetic. So much for Mr. Big Shot Blastoise. Wh what? Call me pathetic, will you? What you've seen of me so far is nothing. Never underestimate Blastoise. Roar! Whoa, look at that sprite or the portrait. Oh, that is some really cool Blastoise art. Whoa, what are you doing? <laughs> there, you're still feeling feisty. That's the spirit. I think we're getting close. Let's keep it going. Oh, so you did that to motivate me. Thanks. Hey, no problem. Let's move. Hmm? What's wrong? Are you still wiped out? No, that's not it. Just now. Did you hear something? I thought I heard a voice. No, I don't hear anything. Is it you? Who disturbs my sleep? Is it you? Who, who's there? Who are you? Show yourself! Me? I was... Created only to fight the most powerful of all Pokemon. The next day, I've always wondered who would be the most powerful Pokemon of all. What? There's someone besides Rayquaza. Is that it? Well, sheesh, Rayquaza destroyed a star. Wow, Buffett! Who else but Rayquaza would be able to do that? Wow, Buffett! But there's Groudon. Isn't that tough? Is that true? Why, even Alakazam's team couldn't defeat it. Wow, Buffett! Legend has it that Groudon shaped continents. It's an incredible Pokemon. Wow, Buffett! Hey, you came along at the right time. We're having a little argument about who the most powerful Pokemon happens to be. Devin, what do you think? Who do you think is the most powerful Pokemon? Rayquaza, Groudon, me! Wabafet, that's where you're supposed to say Wabafet! <laughs> well, uh, I know you want to become tougher, but I hope you never give up chasing your dreams. <laughs> um, I heard this story. Somewhere in the world is a Pokemon that was made for fighting. A Pokemon made for fighting? Yep. They say it has so much fighting power, all it can think of is defeating anything it meets. That's a rather savage Pokemon. I shudder to think. Where might such a horrid Pokemon be now? Rumors say it is storing its power. They say it is sleeping in a dungeon somewhere. That rumor, it's true. Ch Charizard and Blastoise. Oh my gosh, what happened to you? They hurt bad. What exactly happened? Urgh. It's what that why not was saying. We were wiped out by that Pokemon. What? what did you say? Grr, there's no mistake. It said it was made to fight, but that Pokemon's power. There was nothing fake about it. It really was the most powerful. Grr! Oof. 
Ch Charizard, are you okay? There is a cave far in the west. It's there. I never want to go back again. Whoa. Oh my gosh, Blastoise went down too. They need help now. I'll go get someone. Wow, it really exists. A Pokemon that tough. But, you know, we now know that Pokemon is in the Western Cave. I still don't feel like going out there. Well, why would you go? Going anywhere like that would be way too scary. I'm scared too. Wabafat! The cave shunned by all out of fear. The Western Cave is now open for exploration. The next morning. All right, so it seems we have a challenger. It seems we have a challenger for someone claiming to be the most powerful Pokemon, but clearly they've never seen these stats. <laughs> yeah, so we need to go to the Western Cave, I believe it is. Let's take a look at this really fast here. Yeah, there we go, the Western Cave. Again, this unlocks after taking down um, the... Oh, what was that place? I was just there, too. Where are you? Uh... The Western... Or no. <laughs> Man, I'm just... I'm out of it. Where is the darn thing? I don't see it. Mount Faraway. That's what my brain was trying to tell me. <laughs> yes, okay. After you've taken down Mount Faraway, after you've recruited Ho-Oh, that's what unlocks the Western Cave. Now, this used to be a lot more difficult of a dungeon. Now it's only 20 floors, which, to be honest, isn't that bad at all. Now, the boss at the end, I wonder who that could be, they got ramped up a bit, but honestly, I don't think it's going to be a problem. So let me go ahead and get my inventory and stuff all sorted out. Let me make sure that my brain is functioning so I can actually remember the dungeon I just went to. And we're going to go see about this most powerful Pokemon to see if I can take it down. All right, so I'm all ready, or at least I should be. Uh, I also have a lot of money right now, so you know what? I'm gonna deposit some of this. I don't know where I ended up with so much. Shouldn't need that much, honestly. Max Ether, thanks. Uh, okay, there's also this squad here. That was really rough. In front of him, all I can do is be frightened. I never want to go back to such a place, ever. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, thanks for treating me. I'm slowly feeling better. But that Pokemon's power... There was nothing fake about it. I felt it for the first time. This thing called fear. Hmm. Can't believe Charizard came back looking like this. I understand that this Pokemon holds scary amounts of power, but I feel like there was something more to its power. What kind of Pokemon is the most powerful Pokemon in the Western Cave? I don't know. Okay, Western Cave, 20 floors, not that big, but I think it'll actually be fine. Now, I was thinking a little bit about it, and I think I actually want to ditch Zapdos. Uh, okay. I know. Why would I do that? Well, we need some firepower. And when I say firepower, I mean in the form of a flower. So let's bring Sunny along, because you know what? I have Zippy with Sunny Day. I have Sunny with Sunny Day. And I put Petal Dance on instead of... Uh, the other thing. There was something else, but yeah, I, I think that this will work out just fine. So, yeah. Uh, and I did bring a person band as well. So here's a look at my items. Whoops, this isn't going to do. We have those x-ray specs back. And I did bring a person band for you. Somewhere. <laughs> right here. Okay, there we go. And for items and money and all that fun stuff. So I have a pretty nice selection here. Have some apples, elixirs, bunch of reviver seed. Excuse me, reviver seeds. Uh, a band seed. Now this is apparently something that can help stop Mewtwo, the Pokemon we're going to be fighting, because apparently it can recover a lot of health. So I'm thinking if I can throw it at that, that might help. 
But even if not, I think between the all power up orb, the all dodge orb, all protect orbs, all that stuff, this is a great time to use it. I'm also bringing along a link box. I did remember to unlink my moves, don't worry. So yeah, uh, I think that'll be fine. So let's go ahead and depart and see what's waiting for me in the Western Cave. Now I remember back, or at least I remember reading back in the old days, this used to be a very difficult dungeon. I don't remember if it was 99 floors or, ooh, an apple. Um, if it was actually 99 floors or if it was just much longer. But in this, it's only 20 floors, which really isn't that bad. And the Pokemon are entirely different here. They shouldn't be too much of a threat. At least I don't think. Although Jinx really worries me because I know that thing can potentially have Parish Song, and that is very bad. <laughs> I do not want to run into Parish Song here. Uh, why not? Don't ask me. Don't ask me why, ask me why not! <laughs> so we just need to get through this place uh, and then get to the bottom of this. So I guess one thing that almost makes this a little more tricky with it being a shorter dungeon is just the fact that's less of a chance for you to stockpile a bunch of Pokemon to recruit. So I don't know if that'll actually be a factor or not, but we'll see. Um, well, that didn't work very well, now did it? I probably should be using Sunny Day, huh? Yeah, let's set that up. I know it's gonna weaken my my uh, Hydro Pump, but it's honestly not too bad. I think I'll still be fine. Well, <laughs> honestly, from what I hear, the, uh, the Pokemon aren't actually that strong here, although this thing had a lot of health. Feels like it can take a hit fairly well. Uh, all right, what's coming this way? Ralts? Shouldn't be a problem. Ooh, what's this? Citrus Berry, nice. Yeah, honestly, I think by having Sunny Day up, we'll be, we'll be in business. So yeah, the Sunflora, oh man, there's like nothing here. The Sunflora is part of that Sunny Day team that I was using a little bit ago. And I just, I have this feeling like it will help a lot in the fight because Petal Dance, that with Chlorophyll, it just sweeps bosses. Like, it's very good for handling them. Um, I, I have a feeling like this will be a good mix. We'll have to see, though. I have no clue. But I'm excited to find out. And it was either that or Zapdos. And I, I'm kind of done with Zapdos right now. Not that Zapdos is bad, even with, you know, <laughs> Sky Attack. I feel like I just needed to invest a little bit into that. I feel like having all the room clear moves also kind of held it back a little bit. So that thing isn't really a threat, is it? Not really, but I'll sunny day anyway. Bam! Earth power. See ya. All right, so let's head this way. There's a sleeping why not right here. And an apple. Nice to see all these apples again. Oh man. They were definitely hard to come by in the uh, Mount Faraway. I remembered it this time. I was thinking something entirely different. I don't remember what it was, but it was just like, I was looking for it and looking for it. It was like, I don't even remember what the thing was, but I just remember I, whatever it was, it was not what I was looking for there. It's like, I just went there too. How could I be so wrong? How could this happen? All right, let's see. Uh, thankfully, it doesn't really seem like the Pokemon here are that strong at all. I mean, they're surviving hits, but they don't really seem that interesting. Yeah, they're like all psychic types too, which is kind of kind of neat. You know, I bet you what it is, I bet you it's just they put a bunch of weak Pokemon around to make big old battle Mewtwo feel stronger, you know? <laughs> like, let's face it, if you were like, you know, this evil supervillain, right? You know, you'd almost want a bunch of Pokemon that were weaker than you, right? Because think about it, that way, 
you wouldn't have to worry about them trying to take you over. You know, you're still in charge of everyone. But you wouldn't have to worry so much about them, like, trying to, trying to outdo you. So you want them to be strong, but not, like, too strong. I don't know. Here I am thinking of evil supervillain motives and ideas and stuff like that. So there is a Kecleon shop. I wouldn't mind paying that a visit. All right, let's handle this drowsy from all the way across the room. And... Yeah, I want to visit that shop. You know what? I got a bunch of money, and I want to spend it, gosh darn it. Oh my gosh, that thing has over 175 HP. Whoa! Strong! I mean, I guess that's good to see. Just makes me wonder what level it is. Would be nice if I could get something with a rare quality here to help out. Uh, I think it was over this way, right? No, my son! <laughs> my son! Uh, let's see, what do we have here? Guiding wand, yeah, let's... I guess I have to swap, don't I? Uh, here, have this geo pebble. I don't need that. What have we here? Storage orb. Oh, that's really handy. You know what? I might as well use this to put away some things. Like these empowerment seeds. I don't think I need that many. Citrus berry. Wait, wait, I want the citrus berry. Hold on, what am I doing? <laughs> what am I doing? That's mine. Okay, max elixir. I mean, I could drink this. I have so much money. Oh. Well, let me... Okay, that's fine. What's this? Acrobatics, eh. Heal seed, eh. Big apple. Oh, uh, you know what? I'll, I'll eat the big apple. Whoa, hold on. I'm not... I, I pressed down, actually. Well, we'll deal with this. Okay. All right, hold on. There. Now it registered. Okay, yeah, let's go ahead and eat this thing. And what was this? A stay away wand. Oh, I guess I have too many of them. All right, well, I guess this is fine. There we go. Okay. Well, not like the biggest haul. But still got some pretty useful things. Which I guess is good. Okay. Anyway. Onwards, we still have a grand total of like, what, 15 floors to go? Not very many. Oh, no! Thanks, Sunflora. You're awesome. All right, let's get out of here. So... Yeah, I'm really hoping I can just recruit anything that has like a rare quality that could help. Almost wondering if I should put the friend bow on and just really hope for that. Eh, it's fine. I wouldn't mind getting through here rather quickly, to be honest. Oh, there we go. There's a fainted Ekans. Perfect. Even though that thing is going to be completely obliterated by Mewtwo. Honestly, I'm not even concerned. <laughs> it will just be there for moral support, right? Alright, here. Have this apple. Notorious Restoration. Wow, level 62. Um, yeah, I guess we'll just keep going. I mean, not like I was gonna leave. I don't know what the alternative is. <laughs> oh, oh well, it's fine. We'll take the Ekans along. Looks like there's actually a lot of, uh, a lot of sparkling tiles here. That's kind of neat, actually. Jeez, this thing is just tanky. All right. Oh, cool. Free max elixir. Uh, what should I use this on? I guess probably hydro pump. Seems like a good idea. Okay, there's some rocks. Not really anything I need. I don't know how my inventory filled up so fast. Look at this. More Carbos. Uh, I guess we'll use it on Sunny, actually. Okay, the stairs. I am curious what's coming this way. Mr. Mime. Nope. Not having any of that, I guess. It's 
fine. I just, I kind of want more Pokemon. I feel like that would actually be pretty helpful. So there's a monster house up ahead. That should be fun. Actually, what I need to do, let me go step on this thing. What do I have for items? Do I have anything I can like get rid of here? Uh, I guess I can eat a citrus berry. I'll have you eat it. Okay. Oh yeah, I got the storage orb. That's right, I was gonna use that to store some of these items. Well, I'll do it in just a moment. Okay. So I got the max elixir. Where was that monster house again? It's like right down there. I do feel like fighting it. But I also feel like setting up the sunny day first. And the growth, of course. So let's go for it. Oh, the stairs are here too. Oh man, okay, so I needed to be in here. All right, let's spam Petal Blizzard, whoa! <laughs> and just everything gets destroyed. Just clear out the entire room. Abra with defensive rhythm. Uh, doubt that's gonna help, but you know what? We'll take it, why not? Okay, let's switch over to you. So I don't have to worry about stuff. All right, I guess I'll drink some of these max ethers. Looks like there's a lot of them here too. Okay, Carbos. Sure, we'll give it to you, Sunflora. Uh, what is this seed here? Heal seed. Man, that's kind of nice. Might not be a bad idea to pack one. I think I have... a health orb? Yes, I do. Shoot! Actually, I don't even know if I need it. I'm just gonna leave it behind. Alright, let's... Wait, where's Sunflora? Oh, you know what? Theoretically... Theoretically, I could recruit Mr. Mime here. Oh, look at that. That's so good. Hey, there's Mr. Mime. You don't have a rare quality, but that's fine. I won't hold it against you. All right, let's go ahead and drink some of these. Oh man, there was actually a lot of stuff here. I'm kind of surprised. And then this thing was a tiny reviver seed. You know what? I have a feeling like I could use a lot of those. I guess we'll get rid of this max ether. I'll try to top off my power points here. Surely there's a few things I can use, right? But there's max ethers all over the place here. Uh, Petal Blizzard, yeah, let's get some of that back. And, uh, normal blizzard? <laughs> no, I guess I'll get back Flamethrower, right? Seems good. Okay, well that was exciting. Let's get out of here. All right, ninth floor, we're almost halfway through. Uh, yeah, I guess this thing is psychic, huh? Okay, that's that. Let's wake this thing up, cause might as well. Again, I think the more Pokemon I can bring with me on the squad, the better. Certainly doesn't hurt. Well, hopefully it doesn't. Alright, let's get out of here. So, 10th floor now. Looks like the music's changed. Ah, yes. It has a little bit. Uh, okay. Guess we'll go for Heat Wave here. Should I set up the sun? I feel like I should. Let's just go ahead and do that. All right, what else do we have? Looks like there's some Pokemon up here. Hypno. And the stairs, nice. Man, I tell you, I've been able to find these stairs pretty easily this trip. Okay, what's that? It's another Hypno. You don't need to do that, it's fine. Okay, 11th floor. Oh, a fainted pineco. That's kind of interesting. I guess. <laughs> I mean, we might as well go rescue it. Oof, that didn't do enough. It most certainly did not. Okay, let's set up the sun. 
So where was that thing? It was over here. Hmm. I'm not sure I'm gonna do enough with this. <laughs> okay, fine! Do it. Do it then. This is such a weird thing to pick up, but okay. I hope it has something good. Uh, riled up. That's great. That is really great. That'll really help. Because then whenever I take damage, it will raise my attack and special attack. That seems just jolly. Oh, no. That seems just jolly against the big bad boss. All right. Fainted Yon Mega. Ooh, now that actually seems like it could be rather practical, too. I am very much in favor of that. All right, let's go rescue it. It's all the way up there, though. That shouldn't be too bad. It's nice to see that there are a lot of fainted Pokemon here. Actually, that sounds really heartless, doesn't it? What I mean to say is it is nice to see that there are a lot that you can bring along with you for this, this very strong Pokemon, right? Like, that's a nice thing. Because otherwise, you don't have a lot of time to recruit things. Okay, so we're getting set up here. Let's set up the sunny day with the proper Pokemon. There we go. And this thing is getting destroyed. Ooh. Very nice. All right, Yon Mega. Here, have an apple. A uh, bargain. <laughs> uh, sure, why not? That's not helpful at all. At least not for this, but it's fine. Honestly, I think Yon Mega will be good. Actually, let me take a look at your moves. What do you have going on anyway? Bug Bite. That'll be nice. Use that against big ol' Mewtwo. I somehow doubt anyone else has anything interesting. Uh, let's test out Petal Dance. I'm rather curious. All right, here we go. Nice. <laughs> Very nice. All right, stairs. Where are you, stairs? Got to be around here somewhere, right? Uh... <sighs> kind of funny that Spinda's here. Oh, this stupid Yon Mega. That's right. I hate speed boost. It's so annoying. <laughs> it's so annoying because every few turns... It just activates it. Oh, man, I kind of want to send this thing home now. Oh, that's so annoying. Do I already have one of these? Like, I kind of feel like I just want to get rid of it. Wait, there is a sparkling item. Oh, stop being so annoying. Like, that's so rude. Okay, there's the stairs. I've been pretty lucky with stairs so far, honestly. Really can't complain that I had to go such a far away for that. All right, what's going on here? Nothing much. Let's go ahead and do the sunny day growth. Nice way to start your day with a sunny day. Uh-oh, hello. Two. Two. Bam. Get out of here. Yeah, that's why I wanted to bring Sunflora. I figured that it would do a very good job. Okay, Geopebbles. There's a Cacleon shop. Hey, you know what? I can get a bargain there. Hey, isn't that great? Let's go ahead and set this up, because something's coming this way. I don't know what. Kadabra. All right, and it's gone. All right, don't need that. Well, I do still have that storage orb. So, if there's anything, like, really good here, I should be able to, like, buy it and then store things. Like, an evolution crystal, that'd be nice. Nullify orb. Oh, that's neat, it shows a little down arrow. Like, to indicate how much of a discount I get. It's not even that much of a discount, to be honest. I feel like the evolution crystal will be worthwhile. Let's swap out for this Chesto Berry. And... You know what? I'll buy a snack. Why not? It's fine. Will that do? 
I can't switch leaders now, right? Okay, this is fine. Okay. <laughs> Three! Alright, thanks for the discount. Yeah, quite the discount there, huh? Yeah, I think it's kind of a useless ability, a rare quality, but whatever, I mean, you know. I guess there are some nice things you can use for it, but it just doesn't seem worth it. It really doesn't. This is nice, look at that. Alright, let's just take this thing out, like, right now. Let me get a free floor. Oh, it changed music again. Ooh, we get some tense music. Oh yeah, okay. What's going on here? Uh, ooh. Nice, del delicious max elixir. Anything I should get back? Yeah, let's get back some more hydro pump. Okay, all things being equal, let's head over this way. There is an item, just some rocks. Oh, cut it out, would you? Oh, don't do that. What are you doing? You just took a nap right in front of me. Oh, that's so rude. All right, you know what? I'm actually going to leave a zippy here because I'm sick and tired of taking or doing less damage due to this sun. It is really nice, though. All right, I have kind of a bad feeling about this. Okay, weather's clear. We can leave it clear for now. Ooh, sparkling spot. Yeah, I feel like there's a lot of sparkling spots here. That's kind of surprising. Deluxe Ribbon. Oh, yeah! Uh, let's get rid of... Honestly, I have so many Max Ethers and Max Elixirs, like, at home. I don't need them. I don't need to carry any with me. Okay, something else is coming into this room, but it's going to be completely obliterated! See ya, Chime Echo! Alright, Zippy leveling up. And... nothing. Still nothing! <laughs> Stop it! Oh no. Uh... What happened? Is everything okay over there? I have a bad feeling about this. Jeez! Okay, I don't know what's going on. You need to figure this out, got it? Okay, Claydol fainted, thank goodness. Okay, let's do it this way. <laughs> we'll make a little, a, a little bit better of a uh, formation here. Uh-oh, hello. Get out of here. Thankfully, Wubbuffet are not as bad in this game as they are in the main games. Like, Shadow Tag is annoying, but it's not, like, you know, absolutely terrifying. Okay, so this is not ideal. Uh, I think I'm actually going to use Sunny Day and then just hope that some Flora does the thing I need. There we go. All right, what do we have here? What is it? Oh, Life Seed. And another Kecleon shop, what? All right, well, we might as well eat this. Get a little bit of a benefit. Oh man, like everything's coming in here right now. Shouldn't really be an issue. Okay, let's go to the Kecleon shop. See what kind of goodies are over there. You know, if there are a lot of good items, this might actually be a good place to farm Kecleon shops, too. Ooh, an apple. Oh, I can sell my Deluxe Ribbon there. Yeah, I should definitely do that. Uh, what to get rid of? All this stuff's pretty good. 
guess another Max Ether. We're like almost done with this dungeon. And it was so fast. <laughs> like after that 60 floor dungeon, with all that weather and stuff, this is just like a joke. It's so easy. Uh, what the heck was that? Oh, Spinda. Why would you do that? Why would you turn against me like that? We just got done helping you with Ho-Oh. All right, so yeah, let's just go ahead and sell that that thing, right? What do we have here? HP swap wand. That's kind of kind of handy. All right, well this thing we can definitely sell. Max elixir, not really worth it. Surround wand, it's cool but not really that cool. Decoy orb, big apple. It's not even necessary at this point. Charge beam, could be fun. Wait, what was the other one? It was surround wand, right? Yeah, I think it was. Okay, well, this is... Oop, don't give up. I won't. Yeah, 7,500. Let's go. Uh, yeah, sure. You know what? That'll be fine. Gets it out of my inventory. I'm sure I could make more if I brought something with, uh... What is it? Sales pitch? But honestly, it's not that huge of a deal. There's not really that much more I can use money on. I have almost all of the camps. Almost. I I still need to get the uh, the unknown ones. I have to remember to do that. Ah, this Yon Mega. Could you stop? <laughs> it's so annoying. Ugh. All right. All right. Eighteenth floor. Ooh, a fainted crawdaunt. Nice! Yeah, let's definitely go save that thing. Claydol. You can take a blizzard, yep. Mm-hmm. In fact, you can get two. Alright, so it's right up here. Yeah, I mean, we might as well bring that thing along. I'll probably end up getting rid of Abra. I don't actually remember what Abra's rare quality is. If it even has one. It must have one. I just don't remember what it is. Strike Back. That's also great. Oh, this is such a good set for bosses. Very good. Okay, Mr. Mime can use Double Slap, which I guess that's not that bad. Abra has Defensive Rhythm and Teleport. That's it. Honestly, I think we can get rid of that, right? This thing's probably gonna cause me trouble, though. This Ekans. Although, if he uses Acid Spray, that'd be nice. Riled Up is good, just for that. Yon Mega. <laughs> uh, you know what? I, I don't have Yon Mega. That's the problem. Alright, we'll get rid of Mr. Mime. It's not really that useful. Okay. As much as I want to get rid of Yon Mega, I also want to have a Yon Mega. And I don't actually have one. So this way I'll never have to worry about getting one again. <laughs> uh, at least I shouldn't, right? Wow, there are a lot of sparkling tiles here. Really nice to see. Good reward. Uh, man. Okay, hello, Claydol. Have a blizzard! And have another! Oops. I guess I'll just walk here. <laughs> Alright, found the stairs. We're good, everything's fine. It's fine, guys. I have it. It's it's okay. We're already right here. Well, they're just they're just really excited to fight against the ultimate Pokemon, right? That's clearly what it is. Yeah. Uh. Okay. So this should be the last floor. Uh. Uh oh. Blizzard time. Blizzard time. That didn't work. Heal block? Oh, Rude! 
It should be fine. <laughs> Everything's getting destroyed. Jeez, Zippy. Yeah, I wonder why your uh, heat wave is out. Gee, I don't know. Maybe it has to do with the fact that you've just spammed it like 50 times in a row. Just everything is burning. Oh, well, it's fine. All right. Finally, at the end of this extremely long dungeon. Oh, man, it was so long. I can't believe we got through it. Whew, all right. Well, I don't actually know how tough this boss is going to be. So I'm just going to be ready for it. So let's go ahead and link. Oops, let's link everything up here. Because why not, right? That's just smart. Okay. And yeah, we can stop and let's see what's going on down here. You who disturbed me in my sleep. Was it you? My name is Mute. I came into being only to fight. I have secluded myself here in suspended animation. Would you like to know? It's quite simple. If anyone such as you were to come along, I could defeat them at full power. Come on! Oh yeah, here we go. It's time to fight against Mew 2. So, let's see. I don't know how I want to handle this. There are a few things I could do. I think I'm gonna go for a sunny day and growth, just to get that set up. I have no clue what it's even going to do. Like if it has any big room clear moves, like I could and probably should use a, uh, uh, whatchamacallit, an all protector, but I'm gonna see if I can do it without. Okay, let's go ahead and pounce wand this thing. So then we'll all get over here. Some of us doing a better job than others. All right, yeah, you go, Ekans. <laughs> Bug bite, yeah. Okay, um, yeah, there's a lot going on right now. I'm gonna try to position myself here so then I can finally attack like four times, which seems to be a lot smarter. Here we go. Wait, why would you use Petal Blizzard? That's not the right move. Recover. Oh, yeah! 960 HP. All right, I am rather curious about something, though. I want to see if that Band Seed works. So let me turn off Petal Blizzard, because I just want Petal Dance. But I am really curious right now about if that works or not, because if it does work, we don't have to worry about recover. Oh no! I thought I was zippy! Whoops, my bad. <laughs> uh, it's okay. Everything's fine. I have an idea. Yeah, I, I could have sworn I switched to zippy. Oh, that recover is annoying. Alright, well, we'll just throw it from down here. Huh. Yeah, nobody can use Recover now, so that does seem like a really good idea. If you, uh, if you want something to shut down that, that massive Recover, because that is a lot of HP to heal, 960. So, yeah, if you're struggling with that, just bring a Band Seed and toss it. And that should do the trick. Okay, uh, well... I don't really think there's anything else I need to do here. Clearly, I am the strongest Pokemon. You're just a poser, Mewtwo. <laughs> That's all you are! Yep. They need to make a Devon, too. Because I'm just that powerful, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh-oh! 
Mewtwo Mega Evolved! Oh boy. You thought it was over. Nope. Not quite. Uh. Alright, I don't even know what's going on here. There's so much going on. Calm mind. Oh boy. Oh man, I'm doing a lot less now. I mean, I guess it is... It's Mega Evolved, which does make it a lot more durable. It's using Calm Mind. Yeah, this is fun. Oh, that pedal dance is great, though. The <laughs> Just going to town. Oh, poor Ekans. You know what? You fought really hard, Ekans. I'll revive you. I'll give you one of those seeds. Now, I'm actually wondering, maybe Petal Blizzard would be better here. Just because it's physical? I really don't know. Eh, it's fine. We'll just keep up with this. Thankfully, it doesn't seem like it's doing that much. As far as, like, damage. I mean, it used Psychic against Ekans and did, what, 95 damage? I think it's that Recover that's really the big threat. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there we go. Gotcha. Who is the strongest Pokemon now? It's not you, it's Sunflora. Team Maryland's courage in the fierce battle left an impression on Mewtwo. You can now access the Cryptic Cave Camp and... Mewtwo joined your team. Nice, and it comes with Steamroll, that's great. Oh, that's exciting. Sweet! Well, there's the Western Cave. Definitely a lot easier than the, uh, the original. Although I feel like Mewtwo, they did make it harder. But it's easier to get to Mewtwo. And you can also bring in, like, an army and have really good abilities and rare qualities and stuff like that. So, yeah. Um, but I do feel like without that Band Seed, it would have been a lot more difficult. Because that's a lot to heal. Like, you know, if it can just heal nearly a thousand HP whenever it wants, like, that's kind of crazy. But it's fine. We took this thing down. I feel pretty accomplished with that. Uh, yeah, you know what? Riled up seems pretty good. I think we'll take it along. <laughs> Yan Mega. Oh my gosh. <laughs> the stupid thing with with the uh, speed boost. Uh and then Crawdon. Yeah, sure, we'll take you as well. Alright, well there we go. We've gotten revenge. The next morning. Is that it? I need more revenge, though. I need a lot more revenge. I want to see what happened to Blastoise and Charizard. See what they're up to. Hey, I did the thing. Wait, you're not even acknowledging it. <laughs> I just get done kicking that thing's butt. It's Munchlax. Oh, you know what? I think if you see Munchlax there, I think you have to like go into your toolbox or your Kangaskhan and then like leave. And then Munchlax will trip. Wait, what? This doesn't seem familiar. Hey, what's going on? I got your apples for you. Hey, that belonged to Munchlax. Munchlax went back. Yeah, here you go. It's fine. You can have it. R really? Really? You give food back to Munchlax? <laughs> Munchlax feel all squishy inside. You honest and nice. Munchlax light. Munchlax say thank you with this. Munch belt. Munchlax go now. Huh, that's kind of interesting. Usually I run into Munchlax when I'm in Kangaskhan storage. And then it's like, oh, I'm so hungry. I want an apple right now. I haven't seen it drop the apples like that. That's kind of strange. Huh, cool. Well, it's nice that I got the, the munch belt. Wow, so there's like nothing else here with Mewtwo now, is there? Now, from what I hear, Mewtwo is necessary, or at least, well, yeah, having Mewtwo, clearing the Western Cave. I mean, these both, they're in the same vein, but they are necessary in order to unlock a dungeon. But I think there's another dungeon you have to unlock first. From what I hear, you have to go through the Silver Trench as well, so that's gonna be fun. And there's something else, too. So I don't know, I have to 
keep an eye on that, but I know that's one of the conditions. So we'll see what the others are. Well, it doesn't look like Blastoise is even around anymore. I guess he got so humiliated. Oh, wait, there you are. Wait, not you. Sorry, Zippy. Bronze rank. Wow, okay. Doesn't even say, hey, thanks for avenging me. Thanks for, you know, taking down that Mewtwo. <laughs> I guess you're the most powerful Pokemon now, Devin. Yeah, see, they doubted me. I can't believe they doubted me. All right, let's take a look at Mewtwo really fast. Actually, let me do move memory here. Just to see what this thing's all about. I mean, it's bound to be a pretty strong Pokemon. And it comes built in with, uh, oh my gosh, yeah, look at those stats right off the bat. Yeah, let's favorite that thing. Pressure's kind of worthless though, but yeah, look at this. Nice psycho cut. Uh, actually not really that much exciting here, but, you know, it's Mewtwo. Can't go wrong, right? I don't know. I'm just glad I got that thing. Okay, well, anyway, I feel accomplished with that. I still have a bunch I need to go back for and do a few other things with. Like, I want to get the, uh, the legendary trio. We need to get Entei, Raikou, and Suicune. And, uh, yeah, there's probably some other stuff to do. But anyway, we're going to do something else in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time, everyone.